Hi, my name is Jesse, and I am your virtual presenter. I am representing Lady Flex today. I want to talk about a very important health condition that so many of us do not know or ignore. Kleptomania, yes, you heard me right. Kleptomania is a very dangerous mental health disorder. Kleptomania is a mental health disorder characterized by an irresistible urge to steal items even when they are of little value or not needed. Here are some key points about kleptomania. Symptoms Irresistible urge to steal individuals with kleptomania experience an overwhelming compulsion to take things, often without any rational reason. Pleasure after stealing Stealing provides a sense of satisfaction or relief. Anxiety feeling Causes the exact cause of kleptomania is not fully understood, but several theories exist. Low serotonin levels Serotonin, a brain neurotransmitter, plays a role in regulating mood and emotions. Addictive disorders It may coexist with other impulse control disorders e.g. compulsive gambling, alcohol misuse, personality disorders depression, anxiety, bipolar disorder, and even suicidal thoughts. Treatment options medication Naltrexone, an addiction medication that helps reduce stealing urges. Fluoxetine, an antidepressant selective serotonin reuptake inhibitor that may be beneficial. Therapy cognitive therapy, replacing negative thoughts with positive ones. Cognitive behavioral therapy addressing harmful behaviors associated with distress. Psychotherapy talk therapy for mental disorders. Systematic desensitization, gradual exposure to fears. Specialist consult a psychiatrist who specializes in diagnosing and treating mental illnesses. Symptoms of reports If you are experiencing new, severe, or persistent symptoms, contact a healthcare provider. The signs and symptoms may include Irresistible urge to steal items of little value pleasure after stealing items anxiety feeling of guilt depression. Symptoms Kleptomania symptoms may include Inability to resist powerful urges to steal items that you don't need. Feeling increased tension, anxiety, or arousal leading up to the theft feeling pleasure relief or satisfaction while stealing feeling. People with kleptomania usually have these features or characteristics unlike most shoplifters. People with kleptomania don't compulsively steal for personal gain on a dare for revenge or out of rebellion. They steal simply because the urge is so powerful that they can't resist it. Episodes of kleptomania generally happen suddenly without planning and without help from another person. Most people with kleptomania steal from public places such as stores. Some may steal from friends or acquaintances such as at a party. Often, the stolen items have no value to the person with kleptomania and the person can afford to buy them. The stolen items are usually stashed away never to be used. Items also may be donated, given away to family or friends, or even secretly returned to the place from which they were stolen. Urges to steal may come and go or may occur with greater or lesser intensity over the course of time. When to see a doctor if you can't stop shoplifting or stealing, seek medical advice. Many people who may have kleptomania don't want to seek treatment because they're afraid they'll be arrested or jailed. However, a mental health provider usually doesn't report your thefts to authorities. Some people seek medical help because they're afraid they'll get caught and have legal problems, or they've already been arrested, and they are legally required to seek treat. If a loved one has kleptomania, if you suspect a close friend or family member may have kleptomania, gently raise your concerns with that person. Keep in mind that kleptomania is a mental health disorder, not a character flaw, so approach the person. Without judgment or blame, it may be helpful to emphasize these points. You're concerned because you care about the person's health and well-being. You're worried about the risks of compulsive stealing, such as being arrested, losing a job, or damaging a valued relationship. You understand that with kleptomania, the urge to steal may be too strong to resist just by putting your mind to it. Treatments are available that may help to minimize the urge to steal and live without addiction and shame. If you need help preparing for this conversation, talk with your healthcare provider. Our provider may refer you to a mental health professional who can help you plan a way of raising your concerns without making your friend or relative feel defensive or threatened. I hope you are able to learn few things and what to do.
Thanks for watching. I will see you again on my next video.